Hi, my name is Jeff Snavely, and I play clarinet in the Arlington Philharmonic. Today I'd like to tell you a little bit about the clarinet. The clarinet is a woodwind instrument. It's made of wood and has metal keys to cover the holes. It also uses a reed. I'm going to show you a reed here. It's a thin piece of wood cut into a thin shape at the tip. And you place this on this top part called the mouthpiece, and it's held in place by this metal ligature. And when I blow on this reed, it vibrates very fast, so fast that you can't see it. But that vibrates the sound and creates the nice sound of the clarinet. Let me demonstrate a few notes of the clarinet. It can play low. And it can also play very high. used in the orchestra to often play beautiful melody lines, sometimes with the flute or the oboe or the bassoon, or sometimes by itself as a solo. And it also blends in nicely with all the other instruments and can play all different things in the orchestra. It's not as loud as brass instruments like the trumpet, but it can play very softly. Which is kind of nice. The clarinet is used in all different kinds of music, in classical music, in the orchestra, and also in band music. And if you choose to play an instrument in school, you learn to play in the band, along with other woodwind and brass instruments. There's no strings in a band. But clarinets are used, there's a lot of clarinets in a band. In band, you can play things like marches, and in orchestra, you play all kinds of different classical music. I'm going to demonstrate a little bit of classical music for you right now, a piece by Mozart for the clarinet, his Mozart, Mozart's Clarinet Concerto. So that's classical music. I'll play now an orchestra excerpt for you from a piece called Peter and the Wolf, which you may have heard before. And I'm going to play the famous clarinet solo, which is the cat. All right. Now I have another instrument sitting next to me that looks like a clarinet, but it's bigger. And it's in fact the bass clarinet. So it's a bigger version of the clarinet. And it's also used in orchestra or bands to play nice low sounds. Sometimes it plays like a tuba, other times it has interesting solos. I'm gonna play the same Peter and the Wolf solo on the bass clarinet. <laughs> sounds one octave lower than the clarinet. Let me play you its lowest note. And it can also go up high. Like I said, sometimes it plays lines like a tuba. So that's the bass clarinet. It's like a straight clarinet, but it has a curve at the end because it's so long and curved here as well because it's just so long to hold. But it's the same keys as the clarinet and it uses a reed that's bigger. So I hope you, learning, hope you enjoyed learning a little bit about the clarinet family today. Thank you.